Hi, let's see how to fix the linking token not found on Payday 3. Payday 3 is a cooperative first person shooter game that was released in the year 2023. Like any software, it may encounter the errors that can hinder the gaming experience. The error of linking not found is a common problem faced by the Payday 3 users. So let's see what causes the linking token not found on the PD3. The linking token not found error happens when connecting accounts to Starbreeze for the PD3 access. And the linking token token not found error in the PD3 can happen because of the server problems, corrupted data, or the technical problems or the technical hiccups. Server issues like maintenance or a lot of people's playing can mess up the things okay <clears throat> if your game files are broken or old it can trigger this issue or the error usually from incomplete updates or the profile problem or the five problems so let's see how to fix the linking token not found on the pd3 to fix the linking token not found error in the pd3 started by checking your internet connection and updating the game the first method is check your internet connection before making any adjustment ensure that your internet connection is steady and stable any disruptions in the network can cause the issues with the payday 3 okay so make sure that you are having a very good speed with a very good bandwidth and you can try some of the steps from your end by turning off the router or the modem wait for a few seconds and then turn it quick bam turn it back on the problem persists, you can reset your network settings on your device, go to the network settings menu and look for the option to reset or restart the network settings. If you are using a Wi-Fi, try switching to a wired, wired connection to rule out any potential wireless issues. Restart your router or the modem to refresh the connection. The second method is check for the updates. Always make sure that you are using the latest or the updated version. If you are using a older or the outdated version, you can face these kind of issues or the error okay so always make sure that you are using the latest or the updated version in order to stay update of the payday 3 on the steam you have to follow these steps sequentially one by one if you want to stay updated of the payday 3 application on the xbox follow these steps sequentially one by one Similarly, if you want to stay updated of the Payday 3 application on the PlayStation 5, go to the PlayStation 5 home screen, select the game, press the option button, select check for the update, and if there is any kind of updates available, it will be downloaded and installed automatically. And the third method is clear the Payday 3 caches. Every application will have the cookies and caches when you are trying to use the application continuously. Okay. So always make sure to clear the cookies and caches of the PD3 application so that you will not face this kind of error. In order to clear the cookies and caches of the PlayStation 5, follow these steps sequentially one by one. In order to clear the caches on the Xbox, follow these steps sequentially one by one. Follow these nine steps sequentially if you want to know how to clear the caches on the windows what you can do is like you can just go to the run option on run here you can select or you can type percentage local app data percentage and once you press ok find the pt3 folder inside the pt3 folder you can you should see the cache folder right, right click on the folder and select delete from the context menu confirm the deletion when it's prompted once the cache is deleted you can restart the page the fourth method is uninstall and reinstall the application lastly if one of the solutions has worked for you try and installing the application from your device and then again reinstall it from the official website in order to uninstall what you can do is like you can go to the settings and then go to the apps then select the app which you want to delete so here you want to uninstall the payday 3 you can uninstall the application 
it will prompt for whether you really want to uninstall then click on uninstall then it will be finally uninstalled the fifth method is contact the payday 3 support team if you have tried all other troubleshooting methods and if you are still facing the problem what you can do is like you can contact the payday 3 support team for the expert assistance they are the backend team they will help you to fix the particular problem okay so that's all about this. Thank you.